morning guys, welcome to my vlog. You're probably noticing I'm wearing no makeup and an odd combination of clothes, although you probably can't tell. But I'm actually going to the gym this morning. Like, yeah, the <laughs> hold back. I know it's really not a very molly thing to do and it's probably never gonna happen again because there is a reason that I don't do exercise, but I've temporarily forgotten it. But I'm actually going to David Lloyd's with my brother. We're going now. I obviously can't really vlog anything there, but I thought I'd update you, tell you that I'm going just so that I've got this on record that I've actually, and I'm actually going to the gym. I went once in the summer and I actually wore the same top because it's my most sporty top. Um, but we're actually going swimming, I think, so you're probably going to be like, Molly, that's not even the gym, but shh, it's gym enough for me. So, we're going to go, and I'll see you when I get back. Uh, I do have some other things to show you, like stuff I've received in the post this week, and just stuff, just stuff that I'm going to be doing today, but I thought I'd start it now because this is a, a momentous occasion. I'm going out, one, without makeup on, two, to do exercise. Like, what's wrong with me? Harry, where are we going? I love how you put on this fake deep voice, <laughs> David Lloyd. How often do you go to the gym, like on a regular basis? A few oh times God. a week. All right, cool. Get that arty shot of you looking out the window. Oh, arty. Okay guys, I am now back from the gym. I look really odd because I don't have any lipstick on. Um, but I finished my makeup, I had a shower. Um, Got ready, did my makeup, feel a lot more alive. I actually really like my eye today. Um, I was thinking I might film a look like this for a prom video because I kind of want to do a couple of um, prom makeup and hair looks. So um, let me know if this one is something you'd like me to recreate, obviously with a bit more like face makeup and lipstick, but general outline. Anyway, right, at the gym, you'll be proud. I went swimming for an hour and then I did like 15 minutes on a cross trainer. I think it's a cross trainer, I don't really know. I'm talking as if I know what it is. Um, and then afterwards I felt like I died because I'm the least fit person. When I say I don't do exercise, I literally mean I don't do exercise, which is so, so bad. And it's like, they promote it all over schools and like everything, but I'm just not a very fit person. I really don't like sport. <laughs> um, but today I was just feeling kind of motivated and Harry and my dad have gym passes. So I was like, you know what? I'll go. So I went and I kind of feel good for going but not really and now I'm gonna do some revision and I think I might film a like study with me video uh, so let me know in the comments also if that's something you'd like I mean to be honest by the time this goes up you might have already like I've probably already filmed it but I think that's what I'm gonna do now and then Tom is at work currently but once he's finished I think I might see Tom and like go out I'm not really sure depends what time he finishes so that is the plan for today. I feel like this vlog might not be that exciting, but the fact that I went to the gym on its own is quite like a standout moment. Like, what am I doing with my life? Um, so yeah, right now I'm gonna film a video, I think, while I revise. Just before I start revising, I thought I'd show you what I actually got through the post yesterday because I'm super, super excited. So um, I kind of got sent the press release of the new blank canvas cosmetics stuff. So this is the new palette here. So this is their new palette. They have an Instagram and I'll link it below as to where you can find it a bit more. But if I put a torch on it, I don't know if you can see the colours in this, but I really love the highlight shade. Look at that. I've swatched it quite a bit, as you can tell. But yeah, I just think that this is super pretty. So thank you so much to the team at Blank Canvas for sending me that over. And then they also sent me these. So these are a couple of their brushes. You can see which ones they are as they're written on the packaging. But then they also sent me their eyeliner. So thank you so much for sending this over. But then as well as this, I also got a delivery from Coconut Lane. And you might have seen me tweeting about it this week, but they've actually launched sunglasses, which I'm so excited about. And they let me pick a pair when they came out. They were like, do you want to choose a pair? And this is the pair that I chose. Now I absolutely love these. I didn't go for anything like insanely like reflective or mirrored just because I know I'm not cool enough but these are honestly my new favourite sunglasses. They also come with this absolutely lovely marble sunglasses case which I think is so nice. It's really soft. It says Coconut Lane on the bottom and I'm going to be wearing these probably all summer so you can get 20% off with my code BEAUTYSPECTRUM20 which is on screen now and they have so so many sunglasses. You guys know that you can get 20% off everything on their website. I sound like a stuck record when I'm promoting them but I only promote them so much because I love love their brand and I love the team of people that I like chat to that work for them but these are what they look like on now I just think that these are actually not that bad my face doesn't usually suit sunglasses and you're probably aware that usually I do just wear them on my head but I absolutely love these ones I love the gold and yeah it says coconut lane on the side which is so cool so everything on the website you can get discounted but these are their new new products so I'd really recommend checking them out because they have absolutely loads mm -hmm. Okay 
Okay guys, so as you saw, I just was doing some revision and now I'm actually gonna go for a walk and it's also gonna be part of my video that I'm filming, although it looks like it's about to pour down. But I'm gonna meet Tom because he's just finished work and he was like, hey, I finished work early, let's do something. So we're gonna go for a walk on the Westwood, which if you're not from Beverly, it's basically like this massive field. It's not that exciting, um, but it's quite a nice place to take pictures and I thought I could get some filming for the video I just filmed. It's only going up as like an extra. It's gonna go up on Thursday this week and I'm quite excited for it because I love the style I've filmed it in so I'm looking forward to editing it. But right now, surprise, surprise, I'm actually running late so let's go. So I'm with Tom looking at her. <laughs> We've just been for a walk on the Westwood and you saw bits of it, but oh my God, how windy was it? Very windy. It was like the kind of wind where I couldn't feel my ears anymore. But I thought I'd update you while I'm still with Tom to prove that I actually did leave the house today, apart from for the gym. And yeah, well, look at the trees. Such a bad angle. Anyway, I'm gonna go home now. I'm gonna have tea and yeah. Right, okay guys, I'm now back from the walk that I went on and I've just had tea and now I'm on you now and you guys were like, oh, vlog the comments, vlog the comments and then my camera was downstairs. So I've just run to go and get my camera so that I can vlog the comments before I end my you now. So if you guys wanna say hello to my vlog, then say hey and let me know in the comments of this vlog here if you see yourself because we've been having quite a lot of chats about Pretty Little Liars tonight actually. It's been quite old school. But yeah, there's loads of you watching and it's been super lovely. So thank you everybody that said hello. I'm going to stop recording now, but yeah, funky. Okay guys, it's been ages since I've vlogged and I've just been downstairs watching Britain's Got Talent because, well, I say watching Britain's Got Talent, I haven't really. I was actually on FaceTime to Gabby and then we got talking about how much do we think we've spent on makeup, like combined total price that we've ever spent. And to be honest, I don't really want to know because... Oh my god, it'd be bad. But then I was just looking at my eyeshadow palettes that I have in my everyday drawer. So like I've changed my makeup up a little bit. And basically I use this little basket just with to like fill with my everyday makeup. So like the stuff I use on a day-to-day -day basis. And then I took my eyeshadow palettes out of it. Now, I feel like the lighting in here isn't doing this much justice. Like I'll put the torch on my phone on. I don't know if that helps. But these are the palettes that I alternate between on like a daily basis. Um so I got them out and I wanted to add up the price and to be honest guys, it's a lot of money. Like why have I spent this much on makeup? Actually I say me, but I haven't bought a lot of these. Obviously a lot of them are gifts that I've got for like Christmas or birthdays or whatever, which is totally fine. But I was just thinking like, oh my God, makeup is expensive. Like what the heck? Me and Gabby were talking about it for ages. So yeah, I know that I'm gonna get a lot of questions about these because I've just put it on my Snapchat. So just to save you guys some hassle in the comments, I'll talk you through them because you guys might want to know or you might not have watched my makeup collection video. I have done one of those, but it was a couple of months back now. So I'll link it below if you wanna watch more. But these are the chocolate bar palettes. So this one is the chocolate bar. This one's a semi-sweet. This is the Tartlet in Bloom. That is the sleek solstice palette which is actually a highlight palette but i use it for eyeshadow because they're amazing in a corner highlighters especially those two shades this here is the morphe 35p palette um pretty self-explanatory it's the purple palette this is the um coco blend zoeva palette uh i use this all the time actually absolutely love this these are four nyx shades which i picked myself i can't tell you what the shades are i have absolutely no idea but they're those ones there this is a contour palette that i use this one as an eyeshadow this one as an inner corner highlight and this is from the body shop and i absolutely love this um, and then these here are three shades from Sephora's own brand and again I can't remember the name but they're just like compact glitter shades which are really really pretty. So yeah that is my like eyeshadow collection that I use on a day to day basis but I thought I'd talk you through it because I'm getting a lot of questions about the snapchat that I just put up so I thought I'll just talk about it in this vlog and I'm also aware that I haven't vlogged that much today. I'm sorry about that. I'm sorry that it's been quite laid back um, and quite chatty. I have got quite an exciting week coming up. I'm heading down to London to see Liv, so there'll be a vlog with her, which are always my favourite to film, um, because 
I love seeing Lev, love going to London. Um, and it always makes for a good vlog. So that'll be up throughout the week. And I'm also going to see Ed Sheeran. So what a vlog that is gonna be next weekend. So yeah, I'm sorry this one has been quite chilled. Although sometimes I do quite like chatty vlogs. Um, and I did want to update you on this. I'm not gonna end the vlog here because I think I'm gonna go and do a face mask, maybe. Actually, I might not because my skin is kind of starting to clear up and I don't want to give it a reason to get worse again. But I did just think I'd talk you through these because yeah, a lot of you seemed interested. So if I said to you guys that I was gonna do a face mask, I lied, I'm not, because I remembered that I'm going to Gabby's to have a girl's day on Monday. I'm sorry this is so echoey. It's the room, not the camera. Um, but I also realized that I'd got this one out, but I'm gonna save it and do it on Monday night when we have a girly sleepover. Um, so I'm actually gonna use this, which my mum bought for me today actually, because I've had like a really bad breakout of spots that you can't, can't see because I'm wearing about eight layers of foundation. <laughs> but um, I'm gonna give this a go because I don't know, I don't know what's up with my skin. I don't know if it's the products I'm using or what is going on, but I wanna try this out. So I'm gonna give you a first impressions of this Clarisol product, never used it before. Okay, so my makeup's off. First impressions. It's like a little soap dispenser. Don't actually know what you do with this. I presume it's just a face wash. Yeah. Oh my god, I love the smell. Wow, that's nice. Cool, so this has basically gone in my eyes, nose and mouth. Loving this. One thing I will definitely say is why are you done there? And also, <laughs> um, it definitely makes your skin feel super, super soft, like really soft. But then I also use this face wash, which does the same, so I don't know which I prefer. But anyway, my memory card is flashing, so I'm gonna go. Um, I hope you've enjoyed this vlog, albeit very chatty. If you're not subscribed, please do hit that subscribe button down below uh, because that means the world. Give this video a huge thumbs up if you've enjoyed it, and I will be back on Tuesday with a regular upload. Bye, guys.